Hey guys, it's Jamie, and it's it's time, and it's finally here, the Princess Baby Rapunzel tutorial. And this is going to be part one, and I'll have part two down in the description box, as well as my Disney figurine charms playlist as down below as well. And a lot of you have been waiting for a really long time for this, and let's get started. Okay, before we start, I just want to tell you... Um, if you want to show me any of your um, creations or anything, use the hashtag Asian Girl underscore bracelets and also follow me on Instagram. And my link will be down below. And also I will, will be uploading every Wednesdays and Fridays now. So now let's get started. So you're going to need any type of loom. You're going to need a hook. I'm using the metal tipped hook today. And sorry if these are distracting, sometimes I might take it off. And you're going to need, um, these are approximately how many bands you need. You're going to need two clear bands to tie it off. You do not have to use clear bands. You can use the hair color as well. You can, And then you're going to need 26 mango bands or yellow bands for the hair. 22 skin tone bands, and these are the pale ones from the mixed skin tone packs. You're going to need 8 light pink from the mixed skin tone pack and that's over there you need purple and you're also you're gonna need 19 purples and you're also gonna need two green jellies for the eyes oops I dropped one and you don't have to use jelly I just like to you can actually use any color you like so first of all you're gonna start off at your red arrow and you're going to take your two clear bands or whatever color you're tying off on. And I'm going to place it in the middle bar pegs. Like so. And push down. And it's not focusing. Okay. Now I'm going to take my mango colors. And this is the hair color. And I'm taking double bands for the whole entire loom. Unless I tell you I'm not. And I'm going to go diagonally. Diagonally out to the left. And again with two bands, go out to the right. And if I'm going too fast, please pause to catch up or rewatch the instructions. And now we're going to place one row of mango bands. So this is our first row. And then we're going to place in the middle row, like this. So, And then I'm going to take two more, and I dropped a band. <laughs> and I'm going to place it on the right, like this. And now you want to place our skin tone bands. So, sorry if you can hear the packaging. Okay. So I'm going to take two skin tone bands. And I'm going to place one row of skin tone bands. So this is our first one. Or not, this is one row. So this is our first row. And this row. And now we want to take two more. And we're just going to place it on the middle pegs like that. Now let's close off the head. And I'm going to grab two bands. If it let me. Oh my gosh. And we're going to go from diagonally in the inside. Or, yeah, go diagonally inside on both sides. And and, and then let me, go, let me get bands. And then also on the right. Now let's place the neck, and this time we're going to take two bands, like regular, twist it in a figure eight, and loop it upon itself. So we made a cap band, and we're going to place it on this peg, down to this peg, like so. Now let's put on the body. Okay, so we're going to take our light pink. You don't have to use light pink, you can use pink, or you can also use purple or white. I'm going to place it in the diagonally outwards on the left and right. And they kind of look similar to the skin tone bands, if you can see. And we're also going to place two more in the middle, like that. Now let's start placing our purple bands. And I'm going to take double purple bands. And we're going to make... I'm going to put one right there. And then in the middle and also on the right 
Now we're gonna place one more, but this time we're just okay. So we're gonna place it on the left, like so, and then we're gonna place it in the middle, like that. And now we're gonna place it on the right, like so. Okay, this time we're not gonna place it in the middle. This time we're just gonna place it on the left and right pegs. So here's the left peg, and here is uh, the right peg. So this is what the body should look like. And now let's start placing our cap bands and horizontal bands and arms and eyes and stuff. So I'm going to start off with um, light pink, and you can use purple if you like. And these are just for the shoes. So we're going to go to this peg, and this time we have a single band. And I'm going to wrap around this peg three times. One, two, and then three times. Like that. And take one more single band. We're going to go on this peg and wrap around three times as well. One, two, and three. So it should look like that. And then let's go where the arms are. So let's go to the shoulders. like. And then I'm going to take two skin tone bands. Stop focusing. Focus. There we go. And we're going to place it from this peg down to this peg. Like that. And I'm going to take two more from this peg down to this peg. And now let's take our one single skin tone band and go on top of where the arms are. And we're going to wrap around this peg three times. One, two, and three. And also on the other side, take one single band, wrap around this peg three times. One, two, and three. Now let's start adding the eyes. So we're going to go where the hair is, like on this peg where the hair and the skin meets. And we take one single jelly green band. Like I said earlier, you don't have to use jelly green or you don't have to use green at all. You can use blue or anything. So I'm going to go right here and we're going to wrap around this peg four times. One, two, three, and four. And I'm going to take my last green and go on this peg. Wrap around four times. One, two, three, and four. It's not focusing. Okay, there we go. Now let's start placing our horizontal bands. So I'm going to take one single horse, um, skin tone band. And we're going to place it where the eyes are. Okay, it's not focusing. Oh my god, it hates me. It's like focused on my hand. Sorry. And then you want to make a triangle so it should be over the eyes and this peg. Now you're going to do it with one more um, skin tone band. But this time you make a triangle under the eyes. So it should look like this. Now let's move on to the body. I'm going to take one single purple band. I'm going to go on these pegs right here, and we're going to place a triangle. Take one more, and you're going to place a triangle under that triangle. And our last one, this one's a bit different. You want to, you want to place it on this pin, but you want to circle around this peg and place it on this pin. So your loom should look like this now. And we are basically done, almost done with placing our bands down. So please go watch part two and that will be linked again in the description box. And also check out my playlist, Disney playlist in the description box as well. Please subscribe, like, and comment. Remember that I upload every Wednesdays and Fridays and please use the hashtag Asian Girl underscore bracelets to show me your creations and also follow me on Instagram and Twitter and they will be down below as well. So love you all guys all. Bye. Thanks for watching.